Hello there. All right, it's Monday again, which means Mythology Monday, which means that I'm either gonna bore you to death or entertain you. I hope to entertain. Anyways, since I have now dyed all my hair red, um, I decided to do something a little about Aries and love and anger and all that fun stuff. So basically, there's there's one story about Aries that I he just has horrible he's horrible luck. He doesn't really ever win battles. He doesn't do too well. He never marries. No one ever wants to be with him except except for Aphrodite. But she's married to his I don't know. Can't pronounce it. I'm horrible with that name. I always mess it up. But anyway, she's married to him. But he's kind of a cripple and he, no one really likes him. Even his own mother doesn't like him. So whenever he leaves, Aphrodite invites Ares over for a little fun time. So, well, this one time, they were about to kind of get it on and... Hephaestus set a trap, he made this net, and it caught them in the, in the bed, and it froze them, and they were naked. And he's like, hey, all of y'all, and he invited all the gods and goddesses over. And they all just pointed and laughed at, at Ares and Aphrodite, and, and Hephaestus was just going to leave them there. He's just going to be like, fine, you know, you like being with each other so much? There you go. And, but Poseidon because I love Poseidon. He was like, no, you know, you can't do that. It's not really right. Just let them go. And Hephaestus, you know, he was like, oh, I don't want to. But he did. He let them go. And Aphrodite kind of went to her island and she kind of just wallowed there because she was like, oh, I'm so embarrassed. And Ares went to Thrace and he just kind of stayed there and he wasn't very happy. When is he ever happy? But yeah, so that's just a little tiny, one of the better stories of Ares, the warrior god. But yeah, there it is. And it also came from this book, again, came from that book, by him. Later. Holy outtakes, Batman, it's time for the bloopers! Is is Monday again, and I, I, and... She's married to Hephaestus. Hephaestus. He put this. He he made because he he made things. So he. I'm wearing a shirt, by the way. It's a tube top. 